Hi there you guys, so um, I finished the Avengers one and I'm on to the next one. Um, let's just get the book, I can show you guys what I'm going to do next. So we are prepping for Labor Weekend's canvas and then I've got my Halloween one at work. So depending on how quick I get this one done, um, I might bring the Halloween one home and finish it here. Mm, long. So that's the Halloween one. As you can see, very prepared. I could always check my book. Did I write it in here to draw? <sighs> Neighbor Weekend, page 88. Ha ha ha, yes I did. Right. Okay, so it says bad canvas. I'm just having the worst luck by the looks of things. So, um, let's have a look see what is so bad about this canvas. It's probably these bubbles in it. Um, yeah, there's quite a bit of rivers in this one. Not ideal. You can see that. So, some more surgery that I can look forward to. So I've decided um, this is a 44 by 45 pay $24 from the Cami Yee Beauty Store. And it's a full round. I decided what I'm going to do is I'm going to do reverse kitting. So um, if you guys don't watch um, Kicking Cancer's Butt and Diamond Painting, which I sure, I'm sure you do, uh, reverse kitting. So what you do is you take out your colour. So that's 939. I normally start with the highest amount of bags first. So then you let's just get some bags out as well. Right, so what you do is you cut your bag, drill. There you go, cut your bag open. And then it's just uh, pick a spot. What is 939? It's these. Some very odd shapes. What is that? Oh, okay. So that's actually just a black circle. So, um, oh, we've got some D's down here. So just as a quick demonstration, guys, it's just um, on how reverse kitting works so you place your drills so in this instance um, I could carry on but I'm just demonstrating so yes okay so say for instance we've done all our 939s on this one which is D so then we close that up and we pop a remainder of our drills into the bag so the only um, downside from doing a reverse is um, normally when you have them in a container you can just kind of, if you missed an, a, a symbol you can just poke it in the, the container. Um, where is one I can demonstrate that. So say for instance I have them in here instead of in the bags you just open it up oh I missed one you just poke at it and then place that one down so that's the only downfall that you have from that um, other than that what's nice about this is you've pretty much already done your de kitting as you go so I just grab the number of that you can rewrite them if you really want to um, just because of the amount of canvases and the short time that I have to do this in, I'm not even bothering with that. I'm just taking the 939 from 
the bag number, popping that in there, and done. Here we go. That is pretty much how um, the reverse kitting works. So um, I look forward to getting this one done. I'm quite excited to see actually how much of the detail does actually come out of it because um, there's quite a, a big amount of stuff going on. We'll just look at that picture again. There was that 88. So as you can see there, there is quite a lot happening in this picture. I just thought it was actually quite nice to uh, describe Labour Weekend and what it actually stands for. Right guys, so um, just a short and sweet one. I'll try and do another paint with me. Um, haven't done one of those in a while. Uh, so yeah. Um, the main reason I didn't do one on the other canvas is it was just really a very difficult canvas that I needed to sort out. So I didn't want to fuss too much with that one. Okay guys, thanks very much for popping in and I'll see you guys around. Bye!